Hi Aries, so welcome to Self Discovery Support. This is going to be a reading about your person and you. And this reading is going to bring up some truths so you can see who the energy lies with if you know the situation clearly. Um, and also it's going to bring up... Um, Things that maybe we need to look at on each side. Okay, so I'm using the Neoteric Feminine Tarot, um, but it's definitely not exclusive of masculine energies as well. I think all of that is in this deck. Um, I'm also going to use the Love Oracle cards at the end. Alright, so let's look at, um, this is you up here. And this is your person. And I'm asking about, you know, what's happening. What are you experiencing at this point in um, a situation? So you have the Ten of Pentacles, the Devil, and the Knight of Cups. With the King of Wands here in um, your hidden energy. Okay. So. It feels like, okay, there's a commitment. There's actually something that you are very um drawn to very engaged with king of wands is that fiery energy that is the aries energy and so it's like a, a strong kind of sense of moving forward you you are committed to making something happen and you are also very engaged or interested can also be a lot of attraction for the person that you are dealing with here um, Ten of Pentacles does talk about wa wanting commitment or at least having it with this person. The devil also further confirms that type of attraction. But it can also be a kind of, um, you know, a situation where you are in some way kind of drawn, dependent on this person's energy in a way. It's like the two of you have cycles that go back and forth sometimes it's healthy sometimes it's not healthy um i think it talks about the intensity of the situation knight of cups though so i think in 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 the end when it comes down to it you do love this person you do feel strongly for them and i think whatever happened here whatever this situation is maybe you have something that was long term or committed and then it went through this phase of people lost focus maybe you lost focus maybe your person lost focus and it feels like you do want to rectify that is kind of how i'm seeing this the knight of cups still wanting to give that offer still wanting to say I feel this way and with that king of wands it's like very determined energy I'm still passionate about this and I'm still passionate about you seems like what could be coming up for you if you feel this is the other person then that's also gonna be true for you um, we have Virgo Capricorn and um, Pisces energy here as well as um, Leo with the king of wands and um, right under it is sagittarius so some earth energy um a little bit of water for every for, it comes down to this kind of emotional expression for you let's look at your person they have the two of swords five of pentacles ten of swords so they're decidedly a lot more in their head it's a lot more thought that's happening for them um I think for you, there are these strong kind of um, energetic, is what, how I would describe it, energetic and emotional forces for you. Um, but for your person, it feels like there's an inability for them to to decide about the direction. It feels like something has happened between the two of you. You, it's indicating that this person, if you are not together, it would explain why this Five of Pentacles is here. This person is feeling a little bit neglected or isolated. Um, and it just falls right under the devil for you. So it does feel to me like there's a, there's a situation that happened or is happening. Maybe in the recent past it happened 
where um, somebody withdrew, somebody withdrew some attention, maybe not intentionally, but it just, um, these things happen, these dips happen in connections, and it just feels that um, the person is feeling a little bit like shut out, and it's like it went from feeling stuck to feeling isolated, and it just got worse. Ten of Swords here, so this person is feeling that things are maybe closing, and um, I don't know if there's like a no contact situation, but it feels like this person is not feeling the attention, um, not feeling like there's a way to to reconnect, um, and so this person is kind of maybe left waiting. Um, thinking about the future in a way like maybe at a pause not sure where to go with this I think this person is is wanting things to move forward and it's not just move forward they don't want it to stay the same way they want things to heal get better for themselves as well as potentially for the connection as well I want to see um, what your person would say. Let's see, what would your person say? How are they thinking or feeling? Um, Eight of Pentacles. Okay, so it feels like somebody who is open to working this out. It doesn't feel like somebody who has thrown in the towel um, already. Let's see what you would say. Let's just grab that. All right, what would Aries say? judgment okay so it feels like you have had some realizations as well it's like saying i you know to your person that you have seen some things and you do want to maybe reconsider this and that makes sense with this knight of cups it's like you do feel like you would um look at this you might fight for this a little bit that's that fiery king of wands energy um yeah, I feel your person really went through like a difficult period of feeling detached. And I think maybe for you, it's like recognizing what what went off the rails on your side. And also, so it does feel like somebody who has reflected and wants to make um, amends. Your person is hopeful. It feels like even though um, it's saying that they would want to go through a process of working on this methodically. All right, so let's look at um, your love oracle card. Tell us what's happening in this connection. Okay, we have uh, two things. It says karmic relationship and keys on a ring. So, yeah, it feels, yeah, this makes sense. This karmic energy comes through with the devil and the five of pentacles right here. Resentment lessons, letting go and loving you. So it's like this situation got difficult really and with the keys on a ring many options decision unconventional string along one night stand okay so that feels like this could be something that um was quick it was um maybe maybe not what you expected it to be but it's becoming more so it feels like you're at the precipice of feeling like okay this is not how we started it as a committed thing but actually maybe we do want to commit um i see that on your side actually aries and on your person's side i feel like they feel like it's over but um they would want to work on it there's a lot of things here this person you and this person trigger each other in ways that um yeah i brought about this situation but it feels like there's a wanting to heal that so yeah um let's get a last bit of advice for you advice for aries queen of pentacles okay so you could be dealing also with an earth sign nine of swords it, if so you could it could be like let's make the choice for this person but also it's here saying be a little bit more giving um think about someone who is a good partner for you who is nurturing does this person have those qualities and can i return that to them if so you know the nine of swords no need to be anxious about it um i do see that this sits on your head a lot 
All right, Aries. Well, that was your reading. If you enjoyed this, please do give a, give a thumbs up and like, comment, subscribe. Take care. Wishing you all the best and hope to see you back here again.